You know, it's nice when plants do exactly what you want them to do. Like in this case, they're blocking the view of that car. They say an eco-friendly house can't be built in 150 days for $150,000, and I say it can. I'm Alan Smith. Join me as I push the limits with time, budget, and creativity with the Garden Home Challenge, exclusively on eHow Home. Nothing like the sweet smell of fresh soil. Just love it. So what we're doing here is we're putting in a hedge. And it's just not any hedge, it's a native plant hedge, which is important to what we're doing here with this project. We started the landscaping, if you didn't notice. And uh, the idea here is on this far western edge of the property is to put in a hedge that would be able to give the house a little privacy from this busy road and views from other parts of the farm. So this hedge was chosen because I really love native plants. It's a very drought resistant plant. It's native to the southwest. It's called a yopon holly. It has a very interesting history. The yopon is a derivative of an Indian word. Uh, they would drink a tea and European, early European explorers and naturalists thought that they would drink this. It would cause them to vomit. It's like a purgative. This plant got pegged with the name Ilex vomitoria. Ilex is the genus for holly. So this is just one of a an American native holly. What I love about it is it has this tiny little leaf and you can let these things grow really large. They can grow up to 20 feet tall and you can prune them up, or leg them up, or you can let them be bush form. You can cut them into a really tight hedge so they almost look like boxwood or something very formal. So there's a lot of things you can do with this particular plant. And I got a great deal on them. So I thought this is gonna be perfect for screening this side and also screening the upper side of where the cars will park because I don't like to see cars parked everywhere. So if you look here, what you wanna do is you don't wanna ever plant a plant too deeply. And you can see this is the top of the root ball here. So that needs to be level with the soil level. And what the guys will do is they will build what is called a swale around this, which will help collect water. These are being planted with um, a planting medium that has mycorrhizae in it, which is a natural fungus that helps root growth. It'll actually make the plants grow that much faster. And the other thing about these yopon hollies, which I think is so interesting, is they make great habitat for the birds because they produce a red berry. If you're enjoying these ideas and updates on our landscape, Make sure you check in regularly. Tell a friend and subscribe to eHow Home.